I'm Jerry Ford, the beer review guy. I'm gonna do a revisit and just kind of show off a new, um, a new Victoria uh, bottle that I found today. Um, it's it's the one commemorating or um, celebrating the up and coming um, uh, celebration of uh, the Celebra Dia de los Muertos. I think that said it's October 16th or something like that. But that's cool, isn't it? The place I got it was a little pricey. It's $4.59 for this bottle. Victoria beer is one of my top five favorite Mexican beers, so I had to I had to get it. You know, it's just a cool bottle and it's it's a great beer. Um, this is the this is the normal the regular bottle. I did this one last year. Um, so <clears throat> it's four percent ABV. This one doesn't say the ABV on it, but I believe that's the same. It's the same ABV. Let's put this over here. All right. It's been a while, it's probably been a year since I've had one of these. Um, It's, as you can see, it's a, it's a deep, amberish, almost like copper, kind of copperish. Hmm, man, this has a nice, has that dark, you know, the dark, beer aroma kind of like a it's got the yeasty the deep the dark um bread crust kind of a bready um aroma um might be like a, has a kind of a dark malty aroma also um, smell has a light sweetness light to medium sweetness I don't know it might be might have a corn syrup in here I cannot remember and I don't know if it has a hop a hop in it or any hops but there is one thing I do know that I like this beer a lot. Wow, very good. About the same on the taste as I got on the aroma. Has a light to medium malty taste. You get the, the kind of the dark, um, bread crust kind of a um, bready taste to it um, the sweetness is like the medium um, and what it is I, I'm not totally sure if it's um, if it's a corn syrup additive or not um, Very good. Um, carbonation is light. Body is about light to medium. Um, just a very good beer. 
Um, <clears throat> if you like Mexican beers and you haven't tried this yet, you really should try it. It's very good. This is going into my collection. Cap is the same, the same as this one over here. They didn't change that. Excuse me. Okay. I have to see. I think I got. Yeah, I've got uh, <clears throat> to, it's going to be kind of a revisit, but I'm just kind of showing another, another new can. I don't know, you guys have probably already seen this one. Um, also, um, celebrating the Day of the Dead. Another cool, cool can. Celebramos. Cel Dia de los Muertos. Designed by Mr. Cartoon. It's a limited edition. Okay. Can't think of anything else to say about this. <clears throat> I'll probably think of it when I stop the video. It has a very, very light multi bitterness on the back end. It's really not a bitter beer at all. It's just it's a smooth, crisp, clean. It doesn't say that it's an amber or any certain kind. It just it just says Victoria on it. But you put this up to a you know a regular lager beer, and it's way more amber and goldish than this. So I call this an amber or. Um, <clears throat> What else would it be? It's not bitter enough to be like, like a Bach, in my opinion. But, uh, so, excuse me, it might be called, I think it's, I can't think of another style name that these end up sometimes being. All right, but well, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Let me know if you found if you've seen this in your area, and you've gotten one. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. We'll see you on the next one. Salud.